Hi Grade One Twos. Today I'm going to show you how to make a number expander to help in your. Hi Grade One Twos. Today I'm going to show you how to make a number expander to help you in developing your understanding about place value. For this activity, you will need the number expander sheet. You will need a pair of scissors, and you will need a pencil to write your numbers in with. So the first thing we're going to do is to cut out our number expander. So you should cut your expander out into a nice long strip, just like mine. The next step that we need to do is to fold our number expander. On the expander, you've got two types of lines. There are dotted lines and there are solid lines. We're going to fold the dotted lines backwards like this. So they come backwards. And on the solid lines, we're going to fold them forwards. So when your number expander is folded, the words should be hidden. And when we stretch it out, we can see the words again. Now, what I need to do next, now that I've got my number expander, I'm going to roll a dice to come up with the numbers to put in my expander. I roll my dice right here. The first number that I've got, is a six. Then I've rolled a three and my last number I rolled was a four. So I'm going to write those in pencil into my number expander. The reason I'm using pencil is so that I can do lots and lots of numbers with my same number expander by just rubbing them out each time I want to have another go. So now I've got my numbers in my number expander. I can see that when my number is expanded, I have got six hundreds, three tens, and four ones. When I close my number expander up, I can see that my number is 634. If I want to challenge myself and take my thinking to the next level, I can open just one level of my expander. I can open just the one level. And I can see that my number has 634 ones. 634 ones. Or six hundreds, three tens, and four ones. Or 63 tens and four ones. Okay, it's now your turn to have a go. See what numbers you can come up with in your number expander.